to Cleveland for the Game 6 highlights we go. Rip Hamilton and the Pistons looking to keep their season alive. Meanwhile, LeBron James and the Cavs looking to advance to the finals. Larry uses stress, but would only be used in an emergency. We move to the third quarter. LeBron muscles through the defense, throws down the two-handed slam. Cleveland leads by a point. Now more King James comes up with the steal. Gets it back from Eric Snow for the lay off the glass. Cleveland leads 52-47. Then Chauncey Billups kicks it out to Rasheed Wallace. Wallace had a big night from three. Buries it there. Detroit takes the two-point lead. Time now winding down. Flip Murray pushes the ball up court and hits the buzzer beater. We'll take a look at it one more time. This would give the Pistons just a two-point lead as Cleveland cuts into the margin. A two-point lead for the Pistons going into the fourth. Chauncey Billups with the steal off the James spin. Gets it ahead to Tayshawn Prince for the lay-in. Detroit leads 71-69. Now with the shot clock winding down. Phillips, what a tough jumper. Nails it. So it's a four-point advantage for Detroit. Under a minute left, Pistons up by two. Rasheed Wallace misses a three, but Tayshawn Prince gets the back tap to Richard Hamilton. Later in the possession, Wallace misses the turnaround, but Hamilton gets the rebound out to Chauncey Phillips, who gets it to Wallace, who was fouled. After missing the first free throw, Wallace misses the second. Flip Murray has a shot at the board, but no. Ben Wallace comes away with the loose ball, getting it to Chauncey Phillips, and Phillips is then fouled. After making the first free throw to put the Pistons up by three, Phillips misses the second. LeBron gets the board, dribbles up, and gets fouled as he passes to the corner. Looking for a game-tying three, but he's fouled instead. Goes to the line for two, makes the first, misses the second on purpose, and look at this, a near tip home by Zydrunas Ilgowskis, but it doesn't fall. One last look. How close he nearly forces this game to overtime. But the Pistons hang on and win 84 to 82. Rasheed Wallace with the big night. He had 24 points, 9 of 17 from the floor, 4 of 8 in three-pointers. LeBron James did have 32 points and he had 11 rebounds, but he also had 7 turnovers on the evening. And so this game or now forces a game seven, the victory, another two-pointer. That's the way it's been down the last few games between these two teams. A two-point victory for Detroit.